With the new Attack on Titan part released, I was watching it and wondered, what if I build this in Minecraft? But there's just one problem with this plan. I have literally nothing. So here's the plan. First, we kill the Ender Dragon and get an Elytra. Then we start gathering blocks for the build. And then build the Colossal Titan. So let's get to work. So easy. Now that I have the basics, we're going to need to start gathering the resources to build this titan. First, I need almost two sugar boxes of red terracotta, and luckily for me, I live right next to a mesa biome. So, let's go. Okay, so this is all the terracotta we need. And the next block we need is red nether brick, which means we need around 17 stacks of netherrack and nether wood. While this nether wart is growing, I'm gonna go get bone blocks, which are in soul sand valleys and mushroom stems, which I need to find a mushroom island for. This is not gonna be fun. Okay, so that's all the bone blocks we need, so let's head home and find a mushroom island. Let's just head in this direction. How is that so close? Alright, let's start grinding. And that's the last block, so let's head home. And now the final two main blocks we need are nether wart blocks and crimson whatever that word is. So, let's craft some hoes. Then head to the nether and get started. I'm so done gathering resources. And I'm also done having literally no fireworks. So there's only one thing a reasonable man in this scenario would do. Build a creeper farm. But this farm uses a lot of wood. So... Oh my god. We need the totems. Alright, let's go. Oh god. Alright, from that raid we got three totems, which is pretty good. But right now my totem does look like shit. Why are you bullying me? So, like any original hardcore YouTuber, I'm gonna change my totem skin. Ah, much better. Totally didn't take me two hours to find the texture pack. Anyways, with all the wood, pretty much the only thing I need now is a lot of building blocks. But I'm very lazy. So, what happens when someone is very lazy and needs a lot of building blocks and has access to the nether and efficiency of diamond pickaxe? If you guessed netherrack, you'd be correct. <laughs> Alright, with all these materials, let's find where to build the creeper farm. I think right here will be fine. So, let's get started. Alright, now that it's done, I'm gonna AFK for about an hour and see how much gunpowder I get. Alright, it's been about an hour, so let's see. Oh, no. How did this even happen? <laughs> how did this even happen? Well, did we at least get some gunpowder? Oh. I mean, it's not terrible, but I'm too lazy to fix it, so it'll have to do for now. I have everything I need except bomb blocks, so let's quickly go get that and then we can start building. And finally, we got every block needed. So let's go build this guy. First, I need a location and I want to build him close to my base and I also want him facing it. I think right here in this grassy field will be fine. 
and now I just need to clear out this area of grass to make it more flat to build. Alright, with all that grass out of the way, let's start building. Wait, what? I need normal terracotta. But I... Oh, I converted it all to red already. Oh my, that's so annoying. Alright, let's go get some terracotta. Hopefully this is the last time we're doing this. Wait, it doesn't use normal terracotta either. Oh, it's... Oh, it's red concrete. Bruh. It's red concrete. I just wasted 30 minutes of my life gathering useless resources for the build. Let's just start building this guy. I've been building this for almost two hours now, and let's just say he's seen better days. <laughs> but he is absolutely massive. He's almost 30 times my height. Anyways, I'm gonna get back to building. Alright, it's currently 2am and we are basically done with the main body of the titan. We just have his upper legs and some finishing touches. But, you can do that tomorrow. I'm going to bed. Alright, it's the next day, so let's finish the body. And now the titan is fully done, but we're not fully done yet. In the show, when anyone transforms into a titan, it causes a lot of smoke and destruction. So I'm going to make use of campfires and glass to replicate that in my build. But all my tools are really low durability and I desperately need an XP farm. So I'm going to build an enderman farm, but for that I need lots of wool. So let's go shear some sheep. Oh, a pink sheep. Alright, and finally, after some resource gathering, we have everything we need for the build. So, let's head to the end and build this. Gas, please don't, dude. Oh my god, you have to be joking. <sighs> Anyways, after I was rudely interrupted by the gas, let's head to the end and build this farm. I just need to put the water down, build out with leaves, then start building. And that's the Edmund farm fully done. So let's sit here and start enchanting. Now let's head home and add the campfires to the Titan. Now I'm gonna add more smoke manually with glass. For that, I need lots of sand and light gray dye. I'm completely freeballing this so it could go horribly. All right, let's check how it's looking. Uh. All right, I'm hoping if I just keep building it, it will start to look better. And that looks a lot better. Now I'm going to add gray glass to give it more texture. Now at the bottom of his feet, I'm going to add a circle with a lot of destruction. And I need a lot of magma blocks for that. All right, we got all the magma blocks, so let's start building. Now as a final touch, I'm going to add some campfires and some glass. And now the Titan is fully built. 